This is a short video that will show you how to install Wireshark and how to capture data from it to send off for analysis. Just start the install. You can go through the default install options. Just click next. I change my installation folder to D. You can install it wherever you normally install your programs. You also need to install WinPCAP. That happens automatically as long as you have this box checked. When PCAP installs, same way automatically, just click Next. Once the installation is finished, you can either run Wireshark now or run it later when you're actually going to be running the situation where you have the problem or the application. When it opens up, you'll have to select your network adapter. This should be obvious. Just click on that, and it will begin to capture data from your network communication. It will capture all the incoming and outgoing packets. This list could go by very quickly. Once this is open, open the application that you're having a problem with. And make sure that you have the problem a couple of times at least so that the data will be captured during that problem. That's what we really need to see. Once that's done, just click on Stop Capture. And then click on the Save button to save the capture somewhere where you can take it and send it to me later. So just give it any name. It's going to be saved as a uh, WinPCAP file. So give it a name. In my case, I'm just going to call it Wireshark, and I'm going to save it to the desktop. You need to be able to find it later so you can send it to me. And that's it. You can close out of Wireshark. That will leave you with this one Wireshark PCAP file. Send that to me and I can take a look at it.